Hi guys, this is Sarah from The Savvy Professor, and welcome to our video on how to calculate interest on credit cards. Make sure you stick around till the end to learn how to accurately do this through three detailed steps. Number 1. Change the yearly rate into a daily rate. You'll get the daily rate by dividing the credit card's annual percentage rate, APR, by 365. For instance, if your credit card has an APR of 15%, the daily rate will be 0.15 divided by 365, or 0.00041095.89. Number 2. Calculate your average daily balance. The average daily balance represents the balance on your card for each day of the billing cycle divided by 30 for that month or the number of days in the billing cycle. The credit card statement does not include this balance, but you can calculate it from your everyday transactions. Thus, the average daily balance will be day 1's balance plus day 2's balance plus day 3's balance and so on until you get a 30-day balance. Calculating the average daily balance at the end of the month can be tedious since you'll need to go back to all your transactions. Therefore, it's a good idea to note down the balances to make your work easier. Number 3. Determine your interest. The last step involves computing the interest on your credit card. The interest charges are determined by your average daily balance, the credit card's daily rate, and the length of the billing cycle. Assuming your average daily balance is $5,000, the interest will be $5,000 multiplied by 0.00041095.89 multiplied by 30 for a 30-day billing cycle, which totals to $61.64386. It's important to understand that making the minimum payment every month or letting the balance go overboard will cost you more over time. For instance, if you do the same calculation using an average daily balance of $8,000, you'll accumulate $98.63 in interest just for that month. So, there you have it. You can follow these three steps to calculate the interest on a credit card. Feel free to share, like, and comment on the video. Till next time!